The Tale of Genji is a fiction novel referred to the novel and the hair and beard written by Murasaki Shiki. The hair and beard is about 1000 years ago. The protagonist of the Tale of Genji is Genji, the second son of the emperor. His mother was beautiful and had no stages, so as being oppressed by the other wife of the emperor and maid. Emotional distress killed her. Genji became a motherless boy. After Kiritsubo's death, the emperor married Fujitsubo, who was a mirror of her. Genji was in love with her, who looks just like his mother, and he made love with her after growing up. Fujitsubo got pregnant Genji's son, but of course, the adultery was a top secret between them. The emperor had to raise Genji's son as his own. Fujitsubo couldn't stand the weight of sin and became a nun. Being a nun and serving Buddha means cutting off a man for life. Genji could no longer make love with Fujitsubo. Heartbroken Genji picked up and raised a girl named Murasaki who resembled Fujitsubo. Genji wanted to substitute Murasaki for Fujitsubo. She had grown into a wise, beautiful woman just like Fujitsubo. Genji loved Murasaki so much and they became a very close married couple. But in the Heian period, it was rare for a nobleman to love only one woman. One day, the affair of Suzaku's lover and Genji was revealed. Suzak was the emperor and was Genji's older brother. Therefore, Genji lost political conflict and was driven to a rural area for a while. But he returned to Kyo, got promoted, and gained the best power there. Middle-aged Genji married Fujitsubo's niece, Sanomiya. This cheeto made Murasaki sad and she got ill. While Genji was looking after Murasaki, Sanomiya made love with a young man named Kashiwagi. Sanomiya got pregnant Kashiwagi's son and Genji had to play the baby on his own. Murasaki's illness healed and relapsed. Eventually, she passed away, though she was 10 years younger than Genji. Genji raised Murasaki as a substitute for Fujitsubo. But Genji was also deeply saddened by the substitute death. After mourning Murasaki's death for a year, Genji decided to enter the Buddhist priesthood. Genji said goodbye to the worldly life.